Hey guys, how's it going? Jake here. And as you can see here, I got a phone that says iPhone lock to owner. So if you're in the same predicament, you probably bought a secondhand device or locked it by accident like I did. So I'm gonna show you how to remove this lock by just pushing a few buttons. It's super easy and doesn't cost anything. You just gotta do a sequence of things to unlock this screen and it works on any model, on any iOS version. So if you have an older iPhone 8 like this one right here or uh, a newer one, there's really no difference, it always works. So what you're gonna do is push the button. So push the sleep button and then push the sleep button again. And as you can see here, it says the iPhone has been blocked. Tap on the eye on the bottom right. As you can see here, it has an IMEI. You can use this IMEI to unlock your device and it's super easy, I'm gonna show you how. So you need another device, it can be an Android phone or a computer, it really doesn't matter. So just open your browser and on your browser, you're gonna go to unlock here where you can see that Nifty, the AI assistant, will help you unlock your device. So just head over to remove activation lock, which is the issue that you have. As you can see here, uh, you are able to select that you have an iPhone with, with all models supported, even the latest ones, iPads with SIM card slot or Apple Watch. So even an Apple Watch like this one is fully supported and you can unlock it. So what you're gonna do is choose that you have an iPhone uh, from the drop down, And over here, it's asking for your IMEI. And as you can see here, it's showing exactly um, how to get it. So uh, I'm gonna take the IMEI and make sure it's correct. So yeah, that's looking good. Now what we wanna do is we put the phone aside and we're gonna enter our name. So enter your real name because you're gonna get a confirmation email and verify that you're not unlocking stolen property, okay? So it's super important, please do not unlock stolen property. This video contains absolutely no harmful content and is a tutorial for people who truly own their device. Please do not unlock stolen property and follow the terms and conditions. So we wanna check that we consent to the data being stored that basically allows them to send you an email with your order confirmation. And we wanna quickly verify and then start the process. As you can see here, uh, it says that an email has been sent to your inbox. So let's go to Outlook and take a look. As you can see here, it says, greetings from Nifty, your AI phone locking assistant. Uh, you got the unlock for your iPhone 11 Pro Max Gold. So as you can see here, they got the color right, which they found by the IMEI. And it's got the IMEI right here, great news, everything is set up. So let's copy the confirmation code and click confirm my order. As you can see here, it says confirm your order. So now we're entering the code from the email. Quickly select the motorcycles in the picture. All right, now it says validate info and start unlock. Unlock finished, hooray, your iPhone has been unlocked. Perfect, so this is looking very great. It says restart your device. So as you can see here, the lock is still here. So now you're wondering, did it not work? What's going on? Well, it's very simple. Uh, it sent the unlock to the unlock server and it can take up to five minutes. All you gotta do is wait five minutes um, and, then just, and then just swipe back. And it's gonna recheck the activation status with Apple. So as you can see here, it's now checking the information. And we're gonna hang in for just a second here. Depending on your Wi-Fi speed, it can take a few minutes as it says on the screen right here. Wow, as you can see here, data and privacy, that means your phone is unlocked. So let's quickly skip through everything. We don't wanna set up a passcode, we just wanna verify that everything is correct. Don't transfer apps, forget password, set up later in settings and don't use, and then skip through the rest of the setup. Well, have you seen this screen before? I bet you didn't, because this is one of the few activation lock removal services that actually work. So as you can see here right now, the phone is uh, not assigned to any Apple ID and it's fully working. You can do whatever you like. Let's verify the IMEI. As you can see here, the IMEI is correct and everything is working just fine. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much how you can remove the iPhone lock to owner screen from any iPhone model using the service unlockhere.com, or you can remove the activation lock here and lock an IMEI blacklist with just a click of a button. As you can see here, it was super easy. And yeah, if you guys have any questions, leave them in the comments below.